tripled, but you only get one strike. And then the other family gets a chance to steal. Let's play. Thanks, Louie. Welcome back to Power Plays. We only get one chance. One chance at this, Corey. I know. Two more players and we can get going. Let's do it. Yay! They keep cutting you off for a second. They keep cutting them off. A hundred people serving. Mm, it's five, five answers up there. Good luck. This actually might not last a whole part, so <laughs> maybe we shouldn't have cut it off yet. What the fuck, man? What the fuck? How? How can I can get this on the fucking Genesis, but I can't get it on the fucking PlayStation? There must be some kind of fucking delay you figured out. Some timing bullshit. Good answer. Good answer. Is it up there? Better be number one. Unfucking believable. Hey. <sighs> <laughs> Your character went woohoo. Good answer, number one. Number one. What do you gonna do? Play or pass? Family number two is going to play. Oh boy. Sucks for me. I might give the wrong answer then. You might get the right one. Ugh. I'm trying to think. Name something that people seem to have less of as they grow older. Appetite. You never know what's going to be up there. Survey says. I really have one fucking answer, and it's such a stretch. Good guess, but no. Gotta give you a strike. A chance to steal coming up. Okay. Here we go. Let's see if I got this. What? what the fuck? Number two answer. Can he get it? Let's try it out. Number Name something that people seem to have less of as they grow old. I don't think I spelled that right. No. Probably spelled it wrong. It's probably not going to autocorrect it. You spelled it like how like a doctor would spell patience that way instead of the other way yeah. of spelling it. Alright, let's see these fucking answers then. The other <sighs> way has a C in it. Good answer, but it wasn't in our top five. Yeah, cut, fuck you, Louie. Come on, man. Family number two. You did it! Excellent. You fucking did it, Corey. Wow, you almost got 400 points. <laughs> fuck. Yeah. Oh, no, you, that's not, not even your full score. What was in Energy. What was the fourth mm. most popular answer? Mm. See, you need to spell it with a C. Fuck. Making love was the last one. Oh my god. <laughs> I feel fucking dumb now. You're like eight points shy of 400. Fuck me. You ready for the fast money round, Corey? I'm going to try. Oh, boy. Let's see how this goes. Now, if you can stretch this out for ten minutes. <laughs> well, they, don't give you enough, they don't give you enough time for that. Who are you picking? Oh, Grandma. Fine. No, not this stuff. We've already used the joke twice. Thank you, Grandma! Damn, look at that look on her face. She's not impressed. We have our first player. Good luck. The clock won't start until I finish reading the first question. All right, Louie. Show us what you got. In what room do spouses communicate that? Oh, that's a good answer. Corey, the fucking love doctor over here. Don't put SMRT, I swear to God. <laughs> Name an animal you see on country roads. Uh. Come on, your character's fidgeting over there, Corey. Look at her. 
crow. Name a country where auto racing is a big sport. Oh fuck. Damn it. Stop that. What Islam? What? Italy. Name a really boring sport. <laughs> oh fuck, I don't know. What could they want for that? Yeah, I have two answers. I'll give you a hint. Think of one of our national sports. Yeah, I don't know if that'd be in there, though. Or not. I mean, it's it's technically entertaining at some point, watching people yell. Wow, Corey. Try that. All our European fans are gonna be like, did you just say fucking soccer's boring? Well, they'd be like, football, because that's what it's yeah. called over there, so they wouldn't because even they care. Go Oh, bedroom was a good one, obviously. Yeah. Give me one word that means clever. It's a murky smart. Name an animal you see on country roads. Bull. Bullshit. Do you have any family in the country? No. Oh, okay, so. You, yeah, you probably would have seen. You probably wouldn't have had a super good idea for that. Well, I've driven on them with people. Yeah. They probably want something dumb like cow and horse <laughs> and crap like that, not like soccer was not on there. Animal. Thank God soccer wasn't on there. It should have been on We could have angered all of our European fans if it wasn't. Oh, yeah, there. you want to piss off <laughs> CJ. <laughs> what the fuck? Well, he's a Canadian fan, and he probably likes hockey, so you wanted to piss him off. No, not hockey. <sighs> so, oh, you, I wasn't talking about hockey, you no, fucking what, you mean clod. Curling? Yes. Is that what you want? I don't think curling is our national sport. They do it in other countries, Wait, hold too. On, hold on, How do you... Um... Uh... Dick? For God's sakes, Corey. In the dick room? <laughs> Give me one word that means clever. You're not gonna fucking autocorrect it, really? You're not gonna fucking. Oh, now you, you do. Name an animal you see on country roads. Horse and cow. No. My favorite character, cow cow. Name a country where auto racing is a big. Um. You need to pick one that's better than Italy. No, that probably would. Name a really boring sport. <laughs> well, you're not even gonna use your own friggin' thing, really? No. But you wanted me to. Let's take a look I'm at thinking of watching. When I think of watching, I don't know. I should have used curly, actually, now that I think about it. So. You got dining room, really? You probably need to put room. Oh, for fuck's sake. That'd be my guess. Wow. Really? Name an animal you see on country roads. Well, that definitely wasn't number one. <laughs> I was gonna put cat. Racing is a big sport. Yeah. Name a really boring sport. Let's see if this takes it over the top. Yeah, did it. Fail you. <laughs> uh, well, guys, there's no getting around it. Corey wins. This time. Look at look at that fucking jiggle. Oh jeez. <laughs> so Corey won. Uh, our first game of Family Feud for the PS1. He fucking wins. Yeah. Oh, it's yeah. This think... again. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. Fuck. God damn it. It's it's almost worth it losing just to see that. <laughs> Family Feud for the PS1. All right. Well, um...
Fuck. Uh, we technically still have like five-ish minutes for this part to kill, so oh, I'm shit. like, mm, I wonder if there's anything we can explore. Hi, welcome to the family. Um, you, you want to watch the credits for five fucking minutes. minutes? Oh my god, <laughs> it's, oh god. it's like a fucking TV show credits sequence. Bill Carroll. They even had to make, like, a CG, like, recreation of the oh, stage. Because yeah. they couldn't show the actual fucking stage. Look how many fucking people worked on this goddamn game. <laughs> Who made this shit? <clears throat> I guess it will tell us on the screen. He said announcer voice. Louis Anderson. Hasbro Interactive. Oh, this is from 2000. This wasn't even 90s. It was there in the 90s. Yeah, it was made in 2000. So Holy we're shit. terrible. We said 90s a, and we were like wrong. Like a late PS1 release. We were wrong. Uh, apparently so. Fuck. Look at fucking Debbie freaking out on the case here. Bonnie, uh, if you can find the like <laughs> back front and back cover of this, like the PlayStation 1, there's fucking Debbie on the back. She's freaking out. And then right beside Debbie, there's fucking Dave. He's just like, I don't know the answer. boop a doop a doop And then... Uh, the hey, people bro. in the front are way too excited. Those people are 18 years older than that now. Oh my slack. god. <laughs> I bet you Dave looks doesn't look as good there as he does now. <laughs> Louie doesn't look as good as he does now. Yeah, no, I mean, Louie looks worse now. I, I, mean. I saw a picture of him with a full head of gray hair, and he looks weird. He looks like a weird potato person. Blondie, can you please put up a picture of what Louis? Put up a picture of what Louis Anderson looks like now. He looks like a weird, like, white-haired potato man. <laughs> <laughs> That's what he fucking looks like. That's sad. <laughs> so. He's a spud. <laughs> but um, yeah, I, uh, thanks for watching, guys. We've been I've been waiting a long time to play this version of Family Feud. I felt like the Genesis and any SNES version is getting stale, so I didn't want to just play it again. So, and this is the version I actually grew up with. My uh, grand uh, grandmother had it, and when uh, I guess I'll just end this off by telling the story. Um, when uh, there'd be like a week during the summer where uh, a bunch of the grandkids got together and stayed at grandma's place for like a whole week. And this was one that they had, a, she had a PlayStation one. There's two, I remember a lot of playing a lot of Tony Hawk's pro skater two and this basically when we played games, when we weren't outside running around being fucking idiots, playing fear factor by sucking rocks in the, <laughs> in the old fucking like, Oh, and cause my folks or my grandparents lived on like, my grandfather used to own a business building bridges and well that kind of dried up because you rent he ran out of bridges to build um so they had like a bunch of equipment in the next place beside the house and we went in there we <laughs> we would ride our bikes between this little like foresty area or woodsy area between the house and the the fucking where this fucking lot was where all the shit all these uh all this equipment was and we would go in there and like go off ramps and shit it was interesting it was fun there's a lot of that's how i spent that's how we spent a week at summer i think it was near the end of summer maybe it was in middle summer i can't fucking remember when it usually would be what do you remember when like when it approximately would go would it be like august or yeah, around August, July, something like that. But yeah, so this is a I figure. This is a good game to cap off the end of summer. Technically, I know it doesn't end until like near the mid like September. Technically, but it's already starting to get cold. So I have to say, summer's probably over, at least in Canada, anyways. Right now. So, Corey, what did you think of your first time playing Family Feud with Louis Anderson? It was awesome. Was it? I won. Is this now your favorite version? Said. <laughs> that I won. Just because you won, that's all you care about? And I kind of easily won. <laughs> Is this now your favorite version? Do we have to play this from now on instead of the Genesis version? No. Yeah. But sometimes. But sometimes? Sometimes. Okay. Well, guys, leave me a comment to if, see if you want... we get a Steve Harvey version. Thanks for interrupting me, Corey. I'm good at that. Try this again. I'm good at that. So, guys, leave me a comment down below if you want to see more of this version of Family Feud. I'm trying to get a Steve Harvey version. There's one edition out there that's like a DVD board game, but we can record that, so <laughs> we may do that. So, But anyways, guys, I think I filled the time up enough. So next time on Power Plays, 
I don't, I don't fucking know. Whatever Corey and I feel like playing. Pretty sure we each owe each other a penalty mark at this point, so we'll figure that out eventually. So we will see you next time. Really? <laughs> just silent. Just, just, just silent no context. There. No context to that at all.